The Feast of Corpus Christi is celebrated nine weeks after Easter. In Puhili, it's a mixture of Christian and indigenous traditions. People come from all over the district to join the festivities. The procession is led by the mayor and other local dignitaries. Some 50 or 60 dance groups compete to be named the best. The highlight is headdresses. They weigh up to 25 pounds. It takes a strong man to dance for half a day with this on his head. Mirrors reflect away evil influences. This dance represents a hacienda boss and his peons. So they are worth it, okay, right? It's the owner of the land. Dancers in blackface probably reflect African traditions blended with the Christian and indigenous ones. The Negra Mama. <laughs> A 
bystanders may undergo a cleansing ritual. You're expected to give a tip. Drinking is an important part of the festival. By the end of the day, most folks are more or less drunk. The first day's procession was for mestizos, partly European people. The next day is for indigenous dance groups. Again, the mayor leads the parade. Traditionally, masks were worn so the priest couldn't identify who was taking part in these pagan rituals. Women throw candy and oranges to the crowd, perhaps a relic of ancient harvest and abundance celebrations.